Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. It's a beautiful Sunday. We're looking forward to seeing you in the services today. Now, Pastor Larry Stockstill will be preaching, and really, I'm going to be moving counterflow today. So wherever Brother Larry is preaching, I'm going to be in one of the other campuses doing the offering thoughts and kind of keeping all of the campuses tied together. So I'm going to have a great time getting to see different congregations face to face and getting to see other congregations that I normally see face to face by video. So it's going to be a fun day. We we'll look forward to seeing all of you. For our devotional thought today, I'd like us to go to the book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 1. 1 Thessalonians chapter 1 verse 5. Paul said, you know how we lived among you for your sake. You know how we lived among you for your sake. The lifestyle of a pastor, the lifestyle of a connect group leader, the, the lifestyle of any level of leadership in the church cannot just be lived for yourself. As a leader, we no longer belong to ourselves. We, we have to choose a lifestyle for their sake. Let me say that again, for their sake. There are many things that are all right for us to do, but we just don't do them. Well, why? For their sake. Well, why do we have to do this? For the people's sake. Well, why do I have to act like that? For the people's sake. Now, as a leader, you have to understand that the day that we agreed with God that we would become a leader, the day that we accepted that responsibility from God and the anointing of leadership in our lives, whether it's a connect group leader or a children's church leader or a youth leader, when you became a leader, you have to understand, you know how we lived among you for your sake. The decisions we make about lifestyle, the decisions we make about how we live our lives, the decisions we make about our entertainment, the decisions we make about everything in our life is no longer just for us, it's for the sake of the people. We live for the people in Jesus' name. 